Welcome or welcome back to my YouTube channel, CPR Originals. And today, today, today is Saving Shine Sunday Elephant Edition. So day to day, I stuff the some saving challenges I made that are available on my Pay Hip Shop. Link in the description below. Um, and yeah, I stuff it from money this week is coming from some different places. Usually, it's the ones left over in my uh, in my um, wallet. I had some money left over from game night, and I think I had a random $5 bill I stuck in there from somewhere else that I don't remember where it came from. Do you remember, Rigel? Do you remember where that $5 bill came from, Rigel? Okay, let me see if I can get Rigel out of the way. Come on, Rigel. And let's get this started. Now, per my usual, I am not organized. Surprise, surprise, surprise. I am not organized. Let's see, all this goes with this. I don't know if I'm going to do this today or not. This goes with this. And then these go with that. Okay, let's see where we are. I have, let me see. Okay. I had some other challenges sitting here on the side that I thought maybe I might have completed for this. So, we are going to start with this book and this money. And these are the envelopes for this book, and I need these stickers to go with this book. So, and that says October, I need the September. There it should be $72 in this September one. Let us count it and see, because I don't remember if I counted it when I finished it. 5, 10, 15, 25, 35, 45, 55, 65, 6, 7, 8, 9, 71, 72. I think I did count it when I finished it because I, um, it's an order. So, we need to start with the 2023, which is here. And then from 2023, did I finish the turtle one? Did I finish the turtle one? I finished the turtle one. Wow. So, I need 2023, 2024. I need October. I don't have an October envelope. There's my September. And there's my July. I haven't finished. So, this is going to be October. And it actually has a pumpkin looking thing on it. Nice. Nice. So let me write the October on here. So, okay. I need these stickers. I don't need any of this stuff anymore. I just need these envelopes. Okay, get rid of the unnecessary. The unnecessary. I'm gonna start with 2023. I'm gonna scratch off one of these and look at how close we're coming to the end. October, you know what? This one looks like it's already started scratching, so I'm gonna scratch that one. And that's $7. Five, six, seven. Okay, now let's flip over to the back for 2024. And I'm gonna go ahead, these are a dollar piece. I'm gonna go ahead and do one, two, three this month since I have so much money. So, one, two, three. Now, let's go back and color in. Quickly, 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 quickly. We won't want this video to be too long. Quickly coloring. Quickly, quickly, quickly. That doesn't really help when I say quickly, 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 does it? It doesn't make it go any faster, but I think so in my mind. So, wee one more to color. Okay, and I'm coloring in their eyeballs. Didn't mean to be coloring in their eyeballs, but their eyeballs are coloring in because I'm going quickly. There we go. So, put my $3 in my 2024. Where did my 2024 envelope go? Right here at the bottom. Next, before I do October, I am going to go finish up July. So, July... I'm going to do one more on July. I'm going to do the 10, 5, 10. So I'm going to mark off my 10. And then everything else I haven't filled in, I'm going to do with a sticker. <laughs> and these stickers are a little big, but it's okay. Oh, I did have a lot I didn't fill in, but that's okay. I designed it so, whenever, so you could do whatever you wanted to do. I'm gonna double sticker some of these. 
Double sticker. And double sticker. And I need one more sticker. Oh, need two more stickers. I need that one. And let's go with green. I don't have a green on there. There we go. Now I've got all my days covered. Woohoo! So July is finished. I have no idea how much I ended up with in July. But July is done. So this goes to, where does this go when I finish? It goes to retire early. I have to think. I have to remember where I said everything was going to go. Because I don't write things down thinking I will remember. And then I don't always remember. Because that's just me. So I've got 5, 10, 15, 25, 35, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49. I got 49 dollars to go into retire early. So I'll pull that. So July is done. September. And I gotta do October's. I think that works out perfectly. Because I should have eight octopuses. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Oh, wait. Two, four, six, eight. Oh, I have nine octopuses. Nine octopi. I thought I only had eight octopi. Hmm. Uh, I think I'm going to still want to do what I was going to do, which will just leave me one octopus left. So I'm going to go ahead and finish up September, which would be $28. Pink. And I'm not singing my quickly, quickly, quickly color song, am I? Uh, any more color pencils? Any other color pencils? Here's a black one. I see the blue one hiding out in the bottom down there. Oh, I thought I saw the blue one hiding out in the bottom of this thing. Maybe I didn't know. Maybe it just hid even more because it's heard me say its name. Here it is. So that's $28 left, because I had one, two, three, four, that's $28. Five, 10, 15, 25. There's 30, let's see if I've got $2 left. I can pull out of here. Got one, one, two. So that's $30. So that's seven times nine is 63, so this should be $63 to go to retire early. Five, 10, 15, 25, 35. 45 55 61 2 and a third dollar I dropped in my lap there so $63 to go to retire early and then for October I am making each one each octopus is three dollars and I've got two four six eight nine which means it's gonna be twenty seven dollars and I've got should be 24. 5, 10, 15, 20, 1, 2, 3, 4. It's 24. So that means I get to color all except for one octopus. And I think I'm going to leave this octopus right here with a little flower. Or actually, I think that's like just spots there, but it looks kind of like a flower. I think I'm going to leave that one uncolored. So let's see. Let's color our octopi quickly. Do, do, do. I guess I'll talk while I'm doing coloring octopus or octopi. Uh, so anyway, not sure what my video schedule is going to be. I'm going to do my best. I, I'm, I'm, I will get out my Payday Friday video. I always do. I will get out my Sammy Challenge video, Sunday's video next Sunday, maybe. I have stuff going on at work. Every year, it's something we do every year. I always assist with it. I'm always on the team that works on it. And I don't mind, I, I mean, because it's kind of, you kind of volunteer for it. Well, the person who usually leads it this year decided she did not want to lead this year. She wasn't even going to be involved this year. So by default, 
I got stuck as being lead. I don't like being lead. I don't mind helping. I don't mind even taking the brunt of the work on. I just don't like being lead because then when I, when it gets to this close to things need to be done, I start feeling like things are not going to come together. Even though I know every year things always come together. But I stress more when I'm lead and I'm not sure things are going to come together than I do when I'm assistant and I'm not sure things are going to be come together because I know that the lead person is going to do just as much work as I'm doing to get things together because she's lead and she wants it to come together. And I always want it to come together. But anyway, so now I'm stressing about that. So I've got two, we got two weeks and we don't know if it's going to come together. We're hoping it'll come together. I'm sure it will. It always does. I just have to reassure myself. But, um, but we're working on it. So my, my, that's where my brain is going to be the next couple of weeks is trying to figure that out. And I'm just kind of took, made myself sit down and do this today because I wasn't really sure when I was going to do this week, this weekend, because I need to work on some stuff for that as well as I am dog sitting for a friend this weekend as well. Oh, that's more colored pencils so I have to go take care of her dogs today too so so I make myself sit down and do this before I have to go feed and let out her dogs anyway so that is the story of what's going on with me right now stressing over something I probably shouldn't be stressing over and I know I probably shouldn't be stressing over it but it doesn't help me not stress does anybody else have that problem feeder it's probably just me Anyway, so I'm almost finished coloring all these and we can go to the other book and see how much money we have to go in the other book because I don't know. Because as usual, I am unorganized. I got everybody colored except for that one that said I wasn't going to color. Woohoo! I'm going to just leave the color pencils out because I will probably need them. So we're done with this. Yay! You know what that means? We are almost completely caught up with our monthly. So maybe next month, next week I can do October, do, finish up October with the $3 and maybe I can do one of my Novembers because December is going to be tough. December is going to be tough because I've got $10, $10, bills and $100 and that's a bit much for me where I pull this money from. So, well, anyway, that, that's a bit much for me where I pull this money from, but we'll see. I should make it. I'm going to make it. I'm saying it. Like us, like with my project at work, it will all work out eventually, right? So, let's see what I ended up with here with money. Okay, let's see. We got five, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen dollars. We got nineteen dollars. I'm debating whether I want to scratch one on this. I think I am going to scratch one on this. Uh, let's go here. Please don't be a big number so I have money as 10. So that leaves me nine for my other ones. Okay. That's okay. Let's see. Let me find my scratch off envelope. Okay. So we'll put these two fives in. Okay, now let's see what we're going to do in this book with this $9. I'm not starting anything new. So that's not going to get done. I got some dominoes I can do. Cacti, uh, they're only $10 ones. I don't have very many $5 left in that $5 honeycomb, so I'm not, I think I'm going to skip those two. Flower power is done. That $2.50 coloring challenge that I probably should not have started, but I did... That needs to be done. And then I got nothing I can do on square pets. I think I'm gonna skip the thousand dollar challenge. 15 envelope. I'm gonna do five dollars in the 15 envelope. One, two, three, four, five, which leaves me four dollars. And I'm gonna try to do that in two different ones. Cause I think I might can do this in two different ones. We will figure it out. 
as we go. 15 envelope. Okay. I know I can probably do it between the domino and the um, piggy bank. But, so what have I got left? So I know I'm not gonna do the thousand. I know I'm not gonna do the 500. I know I'm not gonna do cacti. I know I'm not gonna do square pets. Scratch off I've done. So these are my three options. Domino, piggy bank, and 250 coloring challenge that I can do $4 in between those. So let's see what we got here. Let's see, piggy bank. I don't have any more ones left. I only have, I have twos left though. Um, domino, I've got a one left in domino, and I've got some twos left in domino. Let's see what we have in my coloring challenge. Do I have a one in my coloring challenge left? I do have a one in my coloring challenge left. So I'm going to do one in my coloring challenge. My coloring challenge is going to get one. I'm going to do two in my piggy bank. Piggy bank's going to get two. And then I'm going to do a one in my domino. There we go. I got all three of them stuffed. There we go. Spread my money around. Woohoo! There we go. I put this money away and put these things away that I don't need anymore. And that's it. That's it. Yay! I hope you enjoyed my little bit of savings challenge video. And I am now going to go and stress over other stuff that I don't need to stress over and go feed some dogs and maybe playing with the puppies will help me. They're not really puppies, but maybe playing with the dogs will help get my mind off things. Even though I have cats, you know, anyway, they're not, cats are not the same as dogs. And I prefer cats to dogs living with me because they're easier to, to, to maintain in my opinion. But that's just my opinion. I'm sure that some people have some opinions, dogs are better than cats. But anyway, <laughs> starting the cat versus dog debate in, uh, uh, here on my channel, not really. I like both of them. I just prefer living with cats because they're just, like I said, they're easier to maintain. If I want to go out of town for the weekend on a whim, I don't have to get anybody to watch them. I can just leave them clean bo litter boxes, extra food, extra water, and then I'll fly out for a couple of days. Dogs, you got to get, you got to, you got to. You, you got to con a friend into dog sitting for you. <laughs> like I got conned into dog sitting, sort of. Anyway, thank you guys for joining me. Like any other YouTube channel, you can like, subscribe, share, all those wonderful things. And my nails look horrible, don't they? Oh, well, it doesn't matter now. It's all over with. Rigel and I say bye. See ya.